The ASEAN Common Submission Dossier Template, or CSDT, forms part of the requirements of the ASEAN Medical Device Directive, which aims to establish harmonized device registration systems across the 10 ASEAN countries, otherwise known as the Association of Southeast Asian Nations. This presentation will start with a brief overview of the regulatory framework in which the ASEAN CSDT is based. We will provide an introduction to ASEAN and its medical device market profile, Introduce the ASEAN Agreement on Medical Device Directive. The next part of this presentation will focus on Introduction to Common Submission Dossier Template, CSDT, CSDT and STED, Sections of CSDT. In this presentation, we will provide an introduction to ASEAN and its medical device market profile. Introduce the ASEAN Agreement on Medical Device Directive. With a collective population of over 620 million in the 10 member states, ASEAN's potential combined market is larger than the European Union or North America. Next to the People's Republic of China and India, ASEAN has the world's third largest labour force. Healthcare expenditure has grown at an estimated compound annual growth rate of 12.4% from 2010 to 2014 in part due to recent and ongoing improvements in public health care schemes. The ASEAN medical device market is rapidly growing and is estimated to double to $8 billion by 2017. With the diversity across ASEAN countries, ASEAN leaders first declared in 2003 the formation of an ASEAN economic community as the agreed goal of regional economic integration. The AEC is built on four key mutually supporting characteristics, a single market and production base, a highly competitive economic region, a region of equitable economic development, and a region fully integrated into the global economy. The AEC Blueprint 2015 was thus initiated at the 38th ASEAN Economic Ministers' Meeting in Kuala Lumpur with the aim to develop a single and coherent plan to progress countries towards the goal of an AEC. Article 8 requires that member states undertake appropriate measures to adopt and implement a prescribed set of common technical documents, which is annexed to the ASEAN AMDD, one of which is the ASEAN Common Submission Dossier Template, or the ASEAN CSDT, under Annex 4. The ASEAN CSDT is to be used for preparation of dossiers for regulatory submission and conformity assessment. At this juncture, it is important to mention that some categories of therapeutic products are not covered by the ASEAN AMDD. Products that are or contain human blood, plasma or blood cells of human origin or transplants or tissues or cells of human origin or animal origin are not covered by the ASEAN AMDD. Examples include human organs for transplant or blood donations. The exception is if the components are incorporated in an in vitro diagnostic product or if they are transplants or tissues or cells rendered non-viable during the manufacturing process. An example is human or animal bone allografts which have undergone demineralization and decellularization treatment processes. In the respective ASEAN member states, such products are or will be subject to different regulatory regime, and the ASEAN CSDT will not apply. <laughs>